Hey, boys and girls. For phonics this week, we're working on the long O. And the long O says its name. It says O. So hope, home, all of those. Cove, anything that has that oak um, would be the long O. I almost said come, and come doesn't work because it has the uh. A uh, sound, it's a rule breaker. That's why it's a sight word. It doesn't follow the rules of the English language. But anything else that has the long O and the final E and makes the O say its name with the O sound is a long O. But today we're doing We Write and we're in our packets on page 16. Um, everybody has this packet and it says We Write and there's two friends and they're writing with pencils. Um, I'm using marker so you can see, but you should be using a pencil when you write. Describe the moon. So yesterday we read about the moon and so now we have to describe it. So hopefully you remember some things from our reading yesterday, um, what the moon is like. The bottom half has the vocabulary word bank. So moon, astronaut, rocket, flashlight, shovel, sniff. Now, both of these, rocket and shovel, have the O in them, um, but they're not a long O. Rocket, it actually sounds more like a short A. Shovel sounds like a U, so those are both rule breakers. Astro, O, not, that is a long O, but it doesn't have that final E, so it doesn't fall into this week's, but it does have a long O. So we're going to describe the moon. What I remember from yesterday is that when you're on the moon, there's no gravity. So you float around. If you remember from our story yesterday, it said they bounce. They bounce because there's no gravity. All right. They also said something about them being light um, as air. I think they said, yeah, they said we're light as air. And then they also said it's dark. So you're in outer space. It's surrounded by pitch black. So those are the ways that I would describe the moon. Um, I don't think they said anything else up there. There are craters on the moon, but they didn't put that in the writing. Okay, so um, I would start out with the moon is, because we're describing the moon. So you're going to have a capital T, and with all of your handwriting, you're going to start at the top. The moon is in outer space so it is dark okay the moon is in outer space so it is dark there is no gravity on the moon. So gravity again is what pulls you down. So I'm able to sit in this chair because gravity is pulling me back down to earth. The moon doesn't have that. So when you go to the moon, you're bouncing and bouncing and bouncing. And if you let go of something, it just floats away. There's something pulling it back down, which is that gravity. So it says the moon is in outer space, so it is dark. There is no gravity on the moon. So you could write something that you remember about the moon from the reading yesterday, but um, that's really what they said in the story is that they have no gravity because they're bouncing and their light is air and that it's totally dark there. So um, good luck. You're on page 16 doing rewrite. Bye, boys and girls.